The sea moth is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. Where is it? There it is! Wow! Good cool! Let's give it a spin! Hi guys! I'm Raging Diesel, and welcome to another episode of Subnautica. Now in our last episode, we went out to rescue Life Pod 17, only again to find it empty. And it looks like Ozzy was attacked and killed by some type of snake-like creature. But we found the remaining blueprints for the mobile vehicle bay, the sea moth, and the laser cutter, and also a cave system in the depths too deep to explore. And we ended the episode starting construction on a new base. This way we could store more supplies and house any survivors that we might be able to rescue. That is, if we find any. So in this episode, we're going to continue building the base and any of that new equipment we might need to continue our adventure. So let's get rolling! Okay, well, here we are back in here. And we did get rid of most of the stuff in our... in our inventory. Uh, I'm going to put this in here just to be certain and we'll eventually sort some of this stuff out. But we do have food and water here, but I wanted to do something as well. One thing I noticed during the last episode was this portion was probably in the wrong spot. So I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and deconstruct this piece hitting Q that deconstructs it and I'm gonna put this piece here and now that I've got it where I want I can expand out into the depths if I need to and I also wanted to put a piece here, but I don't have it yet. Um, I don't have the materials to bake it, but I did want oxygen. Oh, let's get some oxygen. We're gonna have to. Um, we'll put another X compartment here. But can I turn it? I guess not. I wanted another junction. Oh, we got a multi-purpose room. Oh, we don't know how to make it. So maybe we have to get find that somewhere. But I wanted to get... Um, maybe something like this. Oxygen. And we're out. Eventually, I want to be able to go upward to get uh, more more solar panels up on the surface. So we'll go ahead. I'm hoping that there's possible uh, power source. I think I saw it. In the blueprints, screws, walls. Right now, we only have a solar panel for exterior modules. But we can get a vial reactor, maybe an alien containment. We can place signs down. Anyway, we can put some of these things in the new base. So we can actually set this up as our base of operations. Instead of just this small little... Instead of this small little uh, life pod here, but let's get some of these materials here. Let's see, we'll grab that. Eventually, we'll maybe move some of this storage, just like drop boxes or something.
And I'll put this one in here. And see what's in this one here. A little more titanium. And see what we got up in here. Oh, we got a new message. Before we get to that, uh, we'll put these creature eggs away here. Looks like we're full. Let's uh, see if we can make some more titanium. I think we're good with that. What do we have on here? Oh, let's get rid of this creeper vine and make something with it. So we'll make some more lubricant. And we'll come back and use those as like drop boxes. I just remember now we can just go over this and be able to find this. Whoa. we be able to expand at different locations. I think it's better this way. But something said something about Welcome aboard, Captain. This way we can expand into different locations. But we need to get some of this stuff away. So we got titanium here, so we'll put this over here just now. We'll put we got gold. Put these resources in here. Actually, going to need that titanium so we can make some more lockers. But we'll probably need more. So what we're going to do is put this in here. these creature eggs in here put the silicone rubber in here and how are we doing with food and water we're all right we could use it go ahead and consume one of these there we're all good now, see if we can make a couple more of these lockers. Oh, I didn't get that titanium. We can make three more. Now let's uh, try to sort some of this out. We'll put we'll put this back in here along with food and water that we might possibly need. We'll put these in there. Take that copper and this will be resources. We'll name this resources. See what's in here. Okay. 
Okay. Put this in here. Tap. And we'll name that. I think that's right. Precious. Let me know if the guy let me know if I got the spelling wrong. And in here we'll put the ore consider this ores. Or just ore. Nothing in here yet, so we'll put health, food and health. Well, don't have enough space. Let's just put down health. And this is empty, so put down. I'll just put down miscellaneous stuff in here until we need to increase. So we'll put these creature eggs, these flares, and let's go back. Let's go grab some of these guys on the way. So we have some water. Ow! See what the grab trap has to offer us. Oxygen. And we'll go ahead and make our food and then check in here. some water. There. We got new tools. The laser cutter. So we'll be getting those things here in a second but I wanted to get started on getting our base a little more set up in here we'll take some of this stuff here that way we can save it and I'll go ahead and place that in there. Now, do I have room to take one of these as like a drop box? Okay, this one's empty. Not empty. Oh, uh, let's find an empty one. Okay, this one's empty. I'll pack it up. And can I pack up another one?
All right, now we got these lockers. Let's, uh... Where are we going here? Oxygen. Now we go past this. Yeah, this is it here. You can see it barely faintly there in the background. That. <laughs> Welcome aboard, Captain. First thing I want to do is go ahead and deploy these. That way we can kind of like drop things off right away if we need them. What do we got here? Food and water. So let's uh... Here. Let's place some of this food and water in here. resources here. We'll put this uh, tooth in here. This in here. Looks like we got some precious metals. We'll stick that in here. Now we have batteries and stuff like that so we'll just stick it in this locker here. Along with these extra flares. Great. Now, now we got to things we can make. Let's look here. Let's go ahead and make a radio. Looks like we need one titanium and one copper. There's a copper. Do we have any more titanium? we're going to have to make just for titanium I believe so let's go grab ourselves some, some titanium as much as we can let's try to fill up our our backpack full of titanium until we get more Looks like it's getting more difficult to find pieces. Grab some of this salvage up. What is that? Salt. Thirty seconds. Looks like it's sun's coming back up, so we'll be able to find more materials here shortly. Thirty 
30 seconds. Alright, now that we're full, we gotta make sure we're full. See if there's anything down here. Kind of looking for all types of ore, copper. Thirty seconds. Really. Saw some down here. Okay, we got a whole bunch of titanium. So let's see if we can manufacture what we need. That's enough of that. We're going to go ahead and place the radio uh, right here on this side. So. And over on this side, we'll go ahead and place a fabricator. What am I missing? Table coral sample. Um, let's go find some of that. I'm sure we don't have any. Okay. We need a table coral. That's up. Let's see if we can go find some. Oh, looks like we have another message we have to get to. Unless that's not all on a on a timetable. Let's grab a few pieces. Go check our our messages before we get going. Before we... This is Life Pod Six. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Oh, we're gonna have to Signal get... coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Okay. What does that say now?
Life pod six district zero. Six butters coordinates are corrupted. Last available phonographic data has been downloaded and analyzed. Okay, it looks like it's in the sea. We'll, we'll get to that here shortly. Let's uh go ahead and fabricate anything that we can in. It's, I think we'll need that. So we're going to make some of it. Okay. All our resources are done. So let's uh, escape from that. And head back to our our official base. Can we carry any more of this? Yeah, we can. So I'm gonna leave this one here as a drop box here. But we'll take these eggs and stuff over there. So then we can uh start fabricating some more stuff here oh it tells me stuff what I need I didn't notice that in the upper right hand corner it tells me things like I might need to get so we got creep vine here let's uh, go ahead and grab some of that we got a little bit of oxygen left Gotta find diamonds. Welcome aboard, Captain. Where will we find a diamond? Okay, first off, let's go to the fabricator, finish this. Okay. Now I don't know what else I need to make the mobile vehicle bay. We've got that. We need a power cell. What do I need to make a power cell? Two batteries and some silicone rubber. Well, I've got two batteries. I wonder if they need power. And silicone rubber. That should be over in here. Now we just need some lubricant. Um, we're going to put this table coral in here. So I'll put these creature eggs in here. another flare Vital signs stabilizing. And 
see what that does. That did pretty good. Those things gave me a lot. Um. Oh, these are rotten now. Oh, we gotta eat them quickly. These are all rotten. There. Food and water's up enough now. What the heck? Why do these deconstruct? Better. God, I was worried here for a second. Alright, now. I guess we have to do it here. Deployables, mobile vehicle bay. Yeah, that's what we needed. We need to do it here. Good. Now we can deploy it. Release vehicle bay. Where'd it go? There it goes. Well, now we can climb up onto it. I know it's kind of dark here, but it looks like a vehicles. Seamoth. Okay, we've got our titanium ingot. We need another power cell. Two glass. We got the lubricant and the lead. So we're going to make two glass. And a power cell. Do we have enough to make two glass? Let's see. Nope. Yeah, we got enough to make two glass. We can make lubricant. one. We need more quartz. There. We're still needing to find the diamonds, so batteries and stuff. We need a lubricant, so let's make some of that. Since we got it on us. Power cell. We need to make batteries. So let's find this. Okay, we need some acid mushrooms. I know we need to find those, so... Let's see if we can find some here in the shadows. Shallows here.
Here we go. Okay, we got a couple batteries. To make that, we need some silicone rubber, which we have. There we have our power cell. Now we need one piece of lead. That should be enough. I think we have to do it out here on the mobile vehicle bay. is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. Where is it? There it is! Wow! Good, cool. Let's give it a spin. Welcome aboard, Captain. Looks like we got a wreckage here. I thought it was like somewhere here, this bay, right? It was somewhere in these grass. That to damage. Gotta be careful. It's six. Does the make a exploring just a little bit easier? Although I haven't sounded it yet, I'm gonna have to actually. Read that thing again. What's this? Exit is what? Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Seek fluid intake. Oh no! Let's uh, scan this and head on back to base. Reactor. Oh, that'll help. New blueprint acquired. 
Alright. Although it's a little deeper and we got more things to make before we head out to find that, we need to be able to get further down. We'll have to hot key that hot bar that repair tool, but at least we're here. And I know we didn't get to that life pod, but I needed to find it. So let's, before we check that out, um, let's, let's go in here and actually check that message again. Data bank sunk approximately 100 meters. Dense red grass near a number of natural arches and rock slates. Okay, we're gonna have to look for this in the next episode. It looks like it's a in a hundred meters depth. So we'll get our we'll upgrade our um so we'll upgrade our O2 tank and be prepared. gotten water and set up in between episodes I'll get all the necessary items to upgrade our O2 tank and then we'll be able to go out and, and locate that life pot so if you like this video please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for future content don't forget to ring the bell and comment down below you know I love your comments they give me great feedback and they help the channel grow so until next time this is Raging Diesel saying Keep the shiny side up. Goodbye, everybody. See you next week.